Hi, I'm Brian Valcourt, Selectman uh, in Westport, Mass. And I'm here at the site of Coastal Healing today. Uh, this is one of our uh, only, this is our only actually marijuana facility that is applying for a license uh, for both medical and non-medical marijuana. Um, I just want to go over a couple of quick points about uh, the you know, town meeting that's coming up and, and some things that are going on. First off, um, right now, as we speak, uh, both the state in our town uh, legally allow this kind of a business to happen. Um, those laws were, uh, the bylaws were passed in January of uh, 2020 and uh, they supersede the town bylaw that they attempted to um, pass at town meeting uh, this past summer, uh, articles three and four. The uh, state's attorney general has struck both those articles down and said that they were not legal for us to do because they cannot supersede a town zoning bylaw with a general bylaw. Currently, uh, we have a small business that is being invested in by Westport residents, almost exclusively. Um, these are people who are from town. They're our friends and, our, uh, and people that we know um, that really uh, are going to have Westport's best interests at heart. Um, you know, what more would you want than a local investors? I mean, most of these other places that are opening up in this area are people who are from, you know, Colorado, California, anywhere but here. These are people who are from here that are going to run this business with Westport, um, you know, at, at heart. And, that, and, you know, I can't, we can't ask for better than that. Um, and lastly, and mostly, is if this is the way that you treat a new business coming into Westport, the optics of that, when another new business might want to come to Westport, um, is just, it's very difficult to recover from. Um, if you are not business friendly, even if we do manage to get sewer and water down Route 6 and want to attract business, who's going to want to come here if we say, yes, you can do this. Oh, no, you can't do this. Yes, you can do this. I'm you know, here to talk about mainly the legality of this and why we need to embrace this rather than uh, you know, shun it because we desperately need the tax money. Um, this year, the school department is 800,000 short of being able to provide level service. Um, that number is not gonna get any smaller anytime soon. Um, all those numbers. We are down police officers, we are down firefighters, we are down highway department workers, we are down um, office workers within the town hall that provide the services for the town residents. And if nothing else, um, we could pay for quite a few of those positions just with the revenues that would come from a place like this. Now, I am in no way endorsing any particular business over another and I don't want you to think that that's why I'm here. Why I'm here is because I don't believe that we've been fair to Coastal Healing um, and to this particular business um, because they have always exercised good faith in their negotiations with us. And we, I don't think, have. And I feel that um, we need to get this moving forward. We need to allow this to happen. We need to reap the benefits from it and do it in a way in which um, it's a win-win situation, and that's all I have to say. Um, thank you very much. Have a good day.